Folliculitis is a staphylococci infection of the hair follicle, with S. aureus being the most frequent offender. When the bacteria multiplies around the hair follicle entrance and spreads into the follicle, an infection results. Chemotactic substances and enzymes released by the bacteria are what cause the subsequent inflammation. Folliculitis is more prevalent in people with diabetes mellitus or those who have prolonged skin moisture, skin damage, or poor hygiene. It often develops in places that are susceptible to friction, moisture, rubbing, or oil. Folliculitis can present as a raised, tender, erythematous rash with pustules at the openings of the hair follicles. The affected area may also develop crusting. Men are more likely to get these lesions on their scalp, beard, and extremities. If you're finding value in this video, then please hit the thumbs up and subscribe. And check out the link in the description to purchase an instant digital download of the Integumentary System and Disorders Nursing School Notes, which includes the folliculitis concepts reviewed in this video. Folliculitis can be treated with topical antibiotics like mupiracin and washing with anti-staphylococcal soaps like Hibiclens, Lever 2000, or Dial. Additionally, warm compresses made of water or an aluminum acetate solution might be used. The majority of folliculitis cases heal without leaving scars. But if the lesions are deep and widespread, there may be scarring, hair follicle loss, and other complications. It's critical to inform patients about the importance of good hygiene, avoiding skin damage and excessive moisture, and seeking immediate medical assistance if any signs of infection. You can help your patients in managing and avoiding folliculitis by helping them understand the causes, symptoms, and treatments. Thank you for watching and let me know in the comments if you have any questions.